right, so since there was some confusion last time when we demoed the media gallery, today I'm going to show you what the difference is between Pixay media gallery and the actual box media gallery. In Pixay, once you select one picture, you can zoom in and out on that picture, make it very, very pixel and you cannot advance to the next picture at all. Whereas in the media gallery, today, <laughs> if you select the same picture, you can zoom in on that picture and it will get blurry, but not actually display the way it was in the picture. And then you can hit the back button once to go back to the original size or advance to the next picture, which you can also zoom in. And I'm also going to show you a little bit of what the browser looks like. Let's uh, let's pull up um, aldroid.org and take a look at them. Okay, that actually should be a little bit better example of what we're going to try to show you. There we go. Now, of course, I'm loading another site, so. You can blame this on uh, Barack's slow Wi-Fi. <laughs> Anyhow, you can zoom in on the web pages with the same multi-touch. Looks like not a lot of white because we're going to a new page. <laughs> Maybe. Okay, let's stop it. <laughs> there we go. So we can show you an example. <laughs> um, we can zoom in, see the uh, see the form, and you can also uh, double tap to go back, triple tap to zoom in. Quadruple tap to zoom in. <laughs> but still pretty awesome. Multi touch zoom works really well, as you can see, perfectly clear. And there you have it. Is there some kind of multi touch application browser? Yeah, I'm pretty sure because that's, like Dolphin. that's the default. Uh, Bye, y'all.